copyrighted broadcast is presented by authority of the Chicago Cubs and may not be reproduced or retransmitted in any form. And the accounts and descriptions of this game may not be disseminated without the express written consent of the Chicago Cubs. Mark, thank you. Thinking about uh, Scotty Pippen. Right before he sang, he said this one is for Ron and Ernie and Harry. It's a nice touch by Scotty. Yeah, it really was. You know, you saw pictures earlier today or shots of Billy Williams and the Cubs suite. Remember Billy saying, right at the beginning of the playoffs, coming into the ballpark, Lenny and I were walking uh, walking out, and Billy was coming in, and he said, I, I wish my buddies were here. Santo, Ernie Banks, Harry Carey. Think about Jack Brickhouse a lot. Vince Lloyd, Lou Boudreaux, Jack Quinlan. It's time for the ninth inning. T.K. Hernandez will pinch hit and take a strike. Hernandez, a right-handed batter. Cubs lead 5-0. The fan support has been amazing tonight and all season long. And it has been that way for decades. Swing and a miss, 0-2. I always think about the fans, Ron, when the Cubs get close. And they're about as close now as you can get. They deserve it. These fans deserve Every great thing that could happen. Here's a pitch that just missed. It's one and two. Well, the, since I've been a kid coming to this ballpark, the support for this ball club and this organization has been incredible. This ballpark jam-packed the capacity night after night this season. Hernandez strikes out, swinging one away. The Cubs are two outs away from winning the flag. Chapman just rearing back and throwing an absolute rocket of a high fastball past Hernandez. Jason Hayward is the new right fielder. Albert Almora now in left. Ben Zobrist is out of the game. Cubs five, Dodgers nothing, top of the ninth, one away. Carlos Ruiz will bat for Chase Utley. Left-handed pitcher Chapman fires. It's high, ball one. I believe that is Yasiel Puig on deck. Absolutely, that's who it is with that unmistakable physique. There's a strike, one and one. These fans are ready to celebrate. And now the 1-1. One, one. Just outside for a ball, it's 2-1. and one. I think actually some of the fans have already begun to celebrate just a little, and they'll just continue right on through the night. Up and in ball three, three and one. I think they started about 11 o'clock this morning in hopes that they would be in this situation tonight. Wrigleyville was packed when I got here at about 2 o'clock. Cubs trying to win the pennant at Wrigley Field. One down ninth inning, Cubs lead 5-0. Pop fly left side foul down the line. Maybe playable for Russell. Nope, it's out of play. Addison along with Albert Almora both chased that ball, but it was... Back out of play, and now three and two, the count on Carlos Ruiz. Ron, I know you've followed the Cubs since you were a little guy, and then you got to play for the Cubs in 2001, and now these last three years I've enjoyed immensely having you as my partner, but this has to be a special moment for you. 
there's 42,000 others. Same thing. Ground ball foul left side. One down, top of the ninth. Nobody on for the Dodgers. Cubs trying to win it in six games. Now the 3 2 on the way. Check swing. Did he go? No swing. So the Dodgers have a man on. They have not had a man beyond first all night long. That's how good Kyle Hendricks was. Kyle was, was incredible. He had the great fastball, great changeup, really kept every hitter of the Dodgers off balance. Just, just great command and great change of speed. And to go from Kyle throwing 88 to Chapman throwing 103, what a difference. Yasiel Puig pinch hitting, and he will hit a ground ball toward short. Russell goes to Baez, one, over to first. The Cubs are going to the World Series. The Cubs win the pennant.